Hello and welcome to the Gage Look. And we're back with Europa Universalis 4 and the Venice to Byzantium campaign. Now you might have noticed that I'm not live streaming this. There's no little face in the corner. Um, the reason being is I've not been able to live stream recently. Um, just due to work commitments and things like that. Nothing particularly exciting. But I thought I'd carry on this campaign because I don't want to fall out of touch with this one. I do enjoy this one particularly. And let's just make a start. Now I believe we're in the war of the President League, aren't we? And we are supporting the presidents, aren't we? Yes, we are. We have done pretty well against the Ottomans. Again. Um, probably want to take as much as possible from them. But I'm not sure. My war score is not really going to go that way, is it? So what's going on here? I am conquering them down here, yes. And, uh, oh, this is quite a stressful war, actually. It looks like I'm warring on two fronts, which is not like me. So I think we'll just stay where we are. I have some cores to make. Oh, what is this? Uh, are we behind on tech? What, I think we're ahead on tech. Okay, well, let's go for that. Pass the force. Okay. Okay, so we've got a good galley force. We've got um, a tiny trader. I don't know why you're not together. Oh, if you can upgrade, that's probably why. And do we have war maintenance? I think we probably do. Okay, let's make a start. Let's just take the Ottomans out there. Hmm, I'm going to lose that, haven't I? Who are my... Do I have any vassals, actually? I don't even know who my relations are. So Trebizond. Oh, that's right. They're quite decent as well. I've been kind of pushing them up. I'm probably going to lose that battle, I imagine. Or not. Am I ahead of them on military tech? No. How weird. I almost always lose to... Oh, I might still lose, but not badly. Okay, so let's go and kill you. Okay, so Bohemia. Weren't they on my side? God damn it. So you know what my interests are, don't you? Provinces of interest. It's pretty much everything, really. I just want all my old territory back, please. I wasn't intending on doing a Roman run in this, but we'll see how it pans out. You never know. I've got a lot of manpower, which is nice. Where are you going, though? Quite far away, that's unfortunate. Okay, you get there. And you get there. And you get there. Just take them out. What am I doing up here? Am I just holding on? Who are my enemies? I don't even know. Sweden, my enemy? There's not really any large nations who are my enemies here, so let's uh, make sure we help them out. I think you're fine there. Any hostile sieges against me? Niss. Oh, you little buggers. Okay, so I think we will actually come back down and let them go into our territory up there. That's fine. Um... Let's get rid of this, actually, so I can actually see what's going on. Okay. What about military tech? Are we ahead? We are, but we're quite close to getting it, so let's not spend any military power. So, there's some decent forces walking around down here. Let's just ensure that you can't recruit any units in here. Okay, change culture. That's nice. Oh, hello. Oh, Jesus, where are you going now? Yeah, that's not a bad idea, actually. Um, okay, is Lithuania on my side? Yeah, Poland and Lithuania. Okay, so very good. So... Baden. Oh no, okay, I see. 
So they're actually accepting peace with me, or my team anyway. Okay, go help out Lithuania, nice and easy. Okay, so Byzantium, Hess. Okay. Go there, and you go there. They are cap I'm my bloody capital right now, aren't they? You go in there. I'm not a war with Persia, am I? I don't think I am. Lithuania could go take my capital, that'd be lovely. As in defend it. Do I have any military leaders available? No, but I now have a new military tech. And we will move up. And let's hope we don't get caught out too much here. Okay, that's Memigan. Okay, let's wait until you're locked in. You're now locked in, so get in there, please. Um, you're 19th of February, I should be able to defend that. Oh, the Ottomans are around again. Fairly decent forces. Try and blow a hole in that in a second. Hope. Oh, we're going to lose that battle, are we? No. War scores, okay. Go there. Oh, Jesus, 30,000. Where did that come from? Okay, if you can blow a hole in a second. I mean, I think we've won the War of the President League, honestly. I'm not sure why I'm involved in this so much. Okay, Lubeck. So it's really only Austria, Savoy, and the Netherlands and so forth. But there's a lot of people against them. And I've utterly ruined the Ottomans. Let's just make sure we take everything available. Okay, if you come here... that side it is in the mountains which is not great two to one with better military tech I surely should win nice We've got a lot of money coming in as well god it's nice being Byzantium remember we started as Venice in this as well which is probably a really good call for this actually I'm gonna need to go take them out where did that other army go what the hell are you doing up there? Just stay up there, actually. Ottomans are no longer a great power. I could have told you that. You two just stay there. Okay. Bavaria is out of the picture. We're obviously winning this quite considerably. Let's just get us up. Let's get Defender of the Faith as well. We are Orthodox, right? So... Wait, what just happened? I don't know what just happened. Where's this re rebel uprising? Crimean Separatists? Yeah, we know about that. Okay, so the Ottomans are basically out of the picture now. Do I have any spare Diplo slots for after this war? I do. What are my ideas again? It's been, a, it's been a good couple of weeks since i played this. So discipline, missionary strength, tax modifier, manpower. It's all pretty good. Yearly prestige is okay. You could get a policy. Uh, attrition, national garfin. Mm. don't think we're really worried about that particularly. I may end up turning them into a march at some point. In fact, probably not. Okay. Right, so you're buggering about up there, so if we can get you to come here. Do we need a leader, actually? Let's get you an admiral. Okay, I've got hostile sieges in quite a few places, but... Uh, hello. Okay, let's get up there. Yes, yes, Crimean Separatists, I know. Oh, 
Oh wow. Russia all of a sudden. It's gonna be the big bad guys for us. Okay, let's just keep that. Let's get you in there. Let's just keep you there. Man, this war has to be over soon. Can we just get like what sort of uh, land force limit do we have? Uh, we can afford some more troops. Let's get another um, 10,000 here. Yeah, and we'll get some artillery alongside that in a second. But where are my soldiers? Okay. What is this? Saruhan. Yeah, definitely. Come on, guys. It's time. This war is over, right? Don't really know why I'm supporting the presidents, to be honest. Um, personal preference, by any means. Or not, either way. Okay, Saxony is now out of the picture. Who's left? Austria, Savoy, Netherlands and the Ottomans. There's a lot of Crimean separatists there. So. I don't think so. Okay, if we can get you. you. Now, Russia's the other question, though, isn't it? Because Russia won't be small. So we'll have to consider that going forward. One. Of course it did. We can just stick you in there. That's Georgia. If we can uh, get a few of them, let's go take that last Ottoman province. Russia is about. Can we both go into Crimea? Build a supply depot. So you stay there. Where's our hostile sieges now? Oh, that's not an inconsiderable amount of men. Oh, you're going to take that for us anyway. Can we get on this side then? It's quite an exciting war actually. I don't think I'm going to be too pressured, generally. What's our fleet situation like? We can get quite a lot more, so we probably want some more traders. Oh god, look at my money. I thought I was in the money. Hmm. To be very careful there. I would like this war to finish, I'll be honest. I don't want to fight the Russians. Even my manpower is going to be limited. Yeah, come back here, actually. It looks like we're losing some of the Ottomans. If we can get you down here as quick as possible. Poland's walking around with some serious numbers though, which is nice. Okay, if you go there. Can you get over here? Because Persia's pieced out with them. Okay, superb. I don't really want... This is my galley only fleet. Um, sure. Okay, so there is actually Ottomans down here now. So, bloody Poland. Get in there. In fact, no, no, no. You get over here. I'm slightly nervous about what's going on up here. This war has got to be over soon. Can I not peace out in this? Honestly. Oh, hello, Russia. Persia's been a douche. And how are you doing up here? Like, most of this is occupied now. What sort of troop numbers are we talking about? We're about double. Um, 
think a lot of that will be coming from me though and I'm not going to expend my forces against Russia needlessly. So if you can stop there. Okay, so I'm going to need another general here though. So if we can uh, recruit a general I think. just stay in the capital just now. The problem I've got is that's quite a lot of Russians. It's a lot of Polish as well. If you come if you all come over here. Let's go take the Ottomans out. Claim, not the cares. Okay, we've got a big loan there. Can you take that, please? Okay, depletion of the European beaver. Never good. Take that, Let's blow a hole. How are my states doing? Do I have anything to take from my states? Let's get some money. Oh, nothing ready. I suppose you might as well take that actually. Let's make sure they can't get any recruitment at all. They are currently taking Crimea. You know what? No, let's not be silly. There's a lot of troops. Now let's finish this off here and then we'll unite and take these further up. Who's going to rebel now? Ottoman separatists? Oh, that is not an inconsiderable amount of men. Okay, you're not going to catch them, are you? Ah, this war has to be over. Don't want to fight it anymore. Nobody else going to peace out. Austria must be getting pretty close. Anhalt. 168k. It's just the mighty Russia that's involved now, isn't it? And the Ottomans are not just dying either. Okay, there we go. You're over. You're now going to have no provinces that can recruit. Now we're going to finish off Russia. Okay, we can take Defender of the Faith from Russia. Fantastic. And now we can start converting some more. Which is quite good for us. So we've struggled with that a little bit. Okay, superb. If you can get up there. If you can get up there. We have this same... Um, Separatism problem in a second, I think. Hopefully you guys can deal with that. What have we got here, actually? Economic ideas? Um, no, we're actually behind on admin and diplo right now. Okay, so if you can go there, if you go there. for that as well, sure. Okay. Oh. Well, I thought that was Russia that had pieced out there. Okay, superb. So there's not too many people left in this now. I've lost another 10,000 soldiers due to that. God, what a pain in the ass that is. Okay, tech. Nice, we're going to get galley tech. We can do with that. Trade station is also going to be vital for us. Okay, Mantua. Okay, superb. So I think I'll actually take you back up there. Unless... Oh, we're not going to lose that. Um, stick you in the capital. 
I feel like we're good now. Probably gonna need to help out them though, aren't we? Which is a pain. Oh, what the hell? Okay, fine. We come back over there. Still got okay manpower. Maybe we should help wipe out Austria. I mean, they're almost out of the picture anyway. There's my dudes up there as well. Okay, so we took Crimea back, which is nice. Got the Cherson. Cherson? Cherson? Yeah, absolutely. Raising new war taxes. Uh, yes, yeah, so we have all sorts of problems down here, but. Nobility, we need some clergy. Clergy. Oh, it's alright actually. Call for peace was, well, no surprise, we've been at war for bloody years. Uh, yeah. Siege of Mantua. Okay, so we lost Mantua. That is a pity. Um we go up there. Go to Mantua. Okay, so let's start eating up some Russian territory. Conversion done. Our religious unity isn't terrific, so it's going to help us. Okay, there's Antium occupied. Let's take the Azov. Let me get back in there. I'm going to end up with another loan, am I? God damn it. Come on, this is almost 100% this war score now. It is 100% basically. 99, come on. It's embarrassing. Yeah, yes, we've taken another loan, I understand. Your numbers are going down, as are ours, to be fair. Major victory. Okay, Cleves is pieced out. Oh, National Bank has paid. Let us maybe repay that loan. We've got one more. It's not so much interest anymore. Strapple. We'll move our way to Astrakhan. Um, yeah, that's fine. So it's Savoy that we're also at war with, isn't it? Oh man, this has to be over soon, doesn't it? Even Russia is getting conquered slowly. Ah, the Ottomans. Ottomans will see the... Ah, nice. So I got a bunch of territory. We've got all sorts of corruption going on now. We need to make some cores. 37%, 12%, 10%. Nice. Go to Astrakhan, please. Switzerland is pieced out. Good. I would imagine now the Ottomans are down. The Russians are going down. I mean, I've almost got as many troops in the field as the entire alliance now, so that is nice. Call for peace. I'm not surprised, but still not a lot I can do. Route corruption is ridiculously expensive for me right now. Um, but we are making cores. Okay, we took Mantua back. You guys just stay up there just now. I'll take that out as well. Can I make any of these my provinces of interest? I'm sure I tried that already, but Byzantium Ottomans oh, can go to hell. Fabricate a claim. No, can't do that just now. Oh, we can see quite a lot. 
What's going on over there? Just standard colonies. This entire episode has been a war. I like that. Byzantium is growing though. Way. We're on our way to Moscow. I just want to take out as much as possible. Great advisor has died. Uh, morale and navies is fine. Let's not do that anymore. Okay, we converted some more heretics. It's always good. Convert some more heretics. Do I have a metropolitan right now? Yeah, national unrest. Um, okay. Astrakhan should fall. It does indeed. Let's just carve up. So we want to get the Ottomans out of Europe completely. Um, Aragon. They are going out the war now. They are. Hmm. Don't actually expect that. That's quite a reduction in numbers of warriors now, isn't it? Okay, take that. That is a huge amount of Russian soldiers. I am a military tech ahead, I believe. I am indeed. You are about to attack me though. Okay, so Holland. Okay, that's quite major for us, I imagine. Yeah, so it's really just Russia, Austria, and Savoy now. You guys will be going down to try and take land back, I imagine. You head towards Ryazan. Be fine. Move into there. Don't even need to put the rise on anymore, to be honest. Um, to Nishin Novgorod. Go to Altair. Oh, come on, this war has to be over. Okay, you repair for a while. I'd like this episode to finish soon, so if this war could finish soon, that'd be great. Royal marriage from France, sure. What are our dynasties like? They have my dynasty. That is interesting. Hmm. Now, if France PU'd me, maybe we would go for a Roman run. I mean, Byzantium was the aim of the goal here. I actually got there a little bit quicker than I thought I would. I'm usually pretty rubbish at this sort of thing, so. Okay, so Bohemia is the emperor. Why is that a bad thing? Why did you make a bad noise? Russian successful. Fantastic. Okay, send. Is that the other? Oh, come on. This war, honestly, has to be finished soon. Go take their capital. If I can. There's Russians there. We can do it, lads. We can do it. Are you attacking me? You are. Okay, why don't you guys get over here then? be now full. There seems to be pirates there for some reason. Austria has peaced out. Austria has ceded something to me. Hmm. I wasn't actually planning on anything to be ceded to me there. Um, ah, just those provinces. That's fine, I suppose. I expect it though. My overextension's pretty mad right now. Hopefully those cores will be done soon. 
Russia must be about done, right? Come on, off to Moscow, guys, off to Moscow. We get there. We have rebels. That's no real surprise. Okay, so I now no longer have patriarch. I need to consecrate some, I think. Oh, that's a bit painful. Okay, there we go. I think we'll still stick with the national unrest. We are in Moscow. Let us blow a hole. I'm gonna leave our war exhaustion just now. That's fine. Oh, come on, Russia. You need to die. They've got quite a lot of men over here, though, don't they? Oh, it's over. Yes. Savoy will see Cremona. Oh, what? I just gained another. Okay. So was I fighting for the... I don't even know if I was fighting for the Catholics or not. Honestly, I don't know. Presidents or Catholics. Whoever Bohemia was, I suppose. You are Catholic, so I was fighting for the Catholics. Most of that time, I thought I was fighting for the presidents. It tells you how much attention I was paying. Okay. Okay, let's bring you back down. Now, we have huge amounts of overextension. And we're going to have rebels ticking in a second as well. Royal marriage from Cyprus. It's fine. You also have my dynasty. You would be vassalized. So let's improve that relation, and we will do that. And we'll call it there. So that was actually a very exciting episode. Well, by EU standards, of course. That was an entire war for those 30 minutes. And we did very well out of that war. And it was a religious war, and it wasn't even our religion. So let me just bring down these forts. Okay, perfect. We'll call it there. Thank you very much, guys, and we'll see you for the next one.